Yeah, my name G Herbo. G Herbo. I like nasty bitch. I like classy bitch. Look fake sassy bitch. I got ratchet bitch. Bossed up bad bitch. Foreign swag bitch. Alright, bro. What's going on, broski man? S Breezy in the building one time. Stagger. Nobody call me S Breezy. What did I just say? But look, I got a video for y'all today, right? We got today, today we got a good video, man. I want to teach y'all how to become the first ever dribble guy, blah, 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 first ever dribble guy in 2K18. Sorry, I'm drunk. I drank a couple uh, Hennessy's last night. But, hey, it's all good, though. I'm, I'm still alive. But look, I'm going to teach y'all how to be the dribble guy. Dribble guy 101 tips, man. How to be a dribble guy in 2K18. We getting prepared for 18 because it's literally going to be here in about... A month we gonna be prepared for that stuff for a month literally so the prelude gonna be out everybody gonna be trying to make their little playmakers or play shoes or whatever they call that shit man everybody want to claim the title of a dribble guy and whatnot be a combo dribble move and hey i'm here to teach you guys this so let's get straight into it so you want to pick up a ball right if we get on 2k17 in our my court get on your playmaker my man if you want to be a dribble guy Hey, I suggest you do a playmaker. You know, people made it work with sharpshooters. People made it work with lockdowns. People made it work with almost anything, literally. They could make a center and glass clean or whatnot and become a dribble guy. But look, you want to pick up the ball, right? And the best thing to do is just momentum. Like, everybody does the momentum. Everybody gets that crossover. That one time crossover that it's like, if you cross somebody over with it, they on the ground, man. They on, they not getting back up in the next five seconds. So with this momentum crossover, it leaves them on the ground with ease. It leaves them on the ground with just, you know, one move. All you got to do is hold down the back button, which is the R2 if you're on the PlayStation. And then you got to flick your, if you got the ball in your left hand, pretty much all you got to do is flick it right. You got to flick it to the other hand. And that will leave you in the crossover, uh, momentum crossover animation. And it will most likely get you a very very high quality ankle breaker if you have ankle breaker gold or ankle breaker uh what is it called hall of fame so hey this is getting you prepared for 2k18 because if you got hey let's say we got momentum crossovers in uh 2k18 i don't think we will because they are saying that in 2k18 it will definitely lower your stamina if you dribble more often so if you have the ball and you just keep dribbling keep dribbling if you get that whole ball too long animation hey you most likely you won't have your stamina down the more you dribble so hey i don't know if this is going to be killing dribble guys but hey we are out here trying to figure out ways to get past it once 2k18 comes out you feel me so look like i said the best thing to do is just get yourself a momentum crossover man I don't, i'm trying my hardest i'm trying my hardest in this video in this clip right here to do it I can't get it down pack all the time, but hey, we, we can make it work, you feel me? We can definitely make it work. So look, everybody wanna be a dribble guy, right? Everybody wanna be a dribble guy. All you gotta do is do momentums, man. All you gotta do is do momentums, you feel me? But look, hey, everybody do momentums, everybody wanna do combos, everybody wanna do this and that, do half spin moves. Hey, half spin moves work as well. I don't know, sometimes that leave, you, that leave them down on the floor people want to left and right that leave them down on the floor as well man just using left stick somebody is texting the fuck out of me but look if you want to become a dribble guy my dude it's simple you just got to do the left and right cheese you got to do the left stick cheese uh right stick cheese momentum spam crossovers combos if you can figure that stuff out i don't do that combo stuff man that stuff too hard for me i'm gonna be straight up down 100 percent, 110 percent with y'all man that crossover combo stuff i can't get that down pack but that definitely helps you out and uh look hey shout out to my man famous k leaving the party you feel me but look hey look hey get yourself a playmaker get y'all a playmaker most definitely because you got that ankle breaker hall of fame hey practice my dude practice with that try to get your combos and try to get your you know skills and talents down on breaking people's ankles with ankle breaker hall of fame like if you already got a playmaker with ankle breaker hall of fame everybody should got that once they got a playmaker man 2k17 been out for too long hey everybody should have ankle breaker gold or hall of fame at least but you feel me man just get you get on your playmaker if you're trying to become a dribble guy in 2k18 make a playmaker man make somebody that has high dribbling uh, attributes has high playmaking all that shit you feel me so look this is pretty much it that I wanted to show you guys, man. The momentum crossover is very simple. It's a very simple way to get your dude on the ground and whatnot. It's going to be, look, 2K18, we going to be excited for it, right? 
But by the time we get to that stuff, they saying that dribble gods are dead. You feel me? Everybody's saying dribble gods are dead. Because stamina loss is going to be given to you guys. You're going to be receiving stamina loss for dribbling that ball for too long and doing too many moves with it. Hey, we going to find a way. We going to finesse the system. You know what dribble gods do? We bend the rules our own way to uh, get past the defender, man. We get that momentum. We get past them, the speed boots, all that shit. We going to do that stuff. So look, I'm gonna I'm gonna catch y'all later, man. This is just a one-on-one -on -one dribble techniques that y'all could do, getting yourself prepared for 2K18. Cause I'm, hey, I put this on my name, Stay Guy Rank. I'm finna be the first ever dribble guy in 2K18, and that's no doubt. You feel me, man? I ain't lying. I ain't sugarcoating shit. None of that, man. I'm finna be the first dribble guy. Y'all could think Impactual will be. I know I reacted to Impactual. He was very good dribble guy. He's a very good combo guy, to be exact. He doesn't do too many dribble. He's a combo guy. He does a lot of combos. Y'all could say Hank the Tank's gonna be a dribble guy or horse, whatever. He go about horsey. I don't give a. I don't give a dang. But I don't care about Hanky horsey dude. Y'all could say he gonna be it. Y'all could say I run you will be. I don't care about them. I put it on my name, Range Gang Stev got range that i'm finna be first ever dribble guy in 2k18 so i'm putting out everything you feel me so look if y'all want to be a dribble guy take notes by me because a hey, momentum spans all that stuff might be gone soon so we gonna we gonna bend the rules you feel me man so look stay got range range gang 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 cockatoo you already know the movement man i like all right never mind but look <laughs> drop a like on this video if y'all enjoy it and uh make sure you go ahead and leave down a comment so i know how you feel about the channel you feel me gang gang and uh subscribe to the channel and definitely hit that bell so you get notifications on when i upload a video you know notification squad that's who i love the most so be the one that i love the most you feel me man don't be a hater don't be a trash ass whack ass nigga that i don't like and uh you were relevant to me you feel me make relevance in my life you feel me on youtube so that's pretty much it g stay got range uh woo woo i'm out what am i saying dude what the fuck? I'm, I'm gonna just get out of here all right